hey friends welcome back to another tutorial video and today in this video i will let you know how to make a rfid controlled gate or door locking system using rfid rc522 and arduino and along with the for demonstration i have used this as uh, sg90 servo motor and lcd display to see the status and this is the speaker module ISD1280 which will give a voice output so let me show how the project is working so see there are two RFID tags one is accessed one one is not accessed one so when I scan accessed one Access sorry okay so this is not accessed one and this is accessed one so if i scan it will throw an message access denied okay so this is accessed one so when i scan it and also we can able to get a voice message through this you can hear it's saying access granted opening the door It's not only limited with only one RFID tag, we can add multiple uh, RFID tags also. Okay, so without any further ado, let's quickly get started with this video before going to uh, opening. So before going to start this video, my sincere request, please finish. 300 likes for this video and also share this video among with your friends and also subscribe for more such videos and without any further ado let's quickly get started with this video for this project we are requiring a arduino uno a lcd display with i2c RFID RC522 Servo motor ISD1820 module Before making the main connections uh, first of all you need to uh, connect these two uh, like uh, ISD1280 and Arduino uh, like uh, from uh, ISD1820 ground to you you need to connect the ground of uh, Arduino and VCC and VCC will be connected to 5 volt or uh, you can uh, we can use uh, 3 volt also and after it uh, we need to give a power supply and we need to uh, press this uh, record button long press like a uh, uh, like while we are saying uh, any command we we need to keep on uh, press this record button so i am pressing now access granted so this message will be stored and when uh, the uh, rfid uh, scanned then the message will be come as access granted through this mic to make uh, the locking and unlocking uh, mechanism i uh, stick a stick i stick the servo motor and a stick uh, between this uh, locking system and servo motor like this so that if servo rotates then it will drag accordingly uh, like when uh, it's uh, pushes then it will go to lock okay follow this circuit diagram and make your connections
so this is the code which we need to upload here uh, we are using these libraries if you don't know how to install uh, libraries uh, here uh, the video is linked in description down below you can uh, refer that one to uh, like uh, install these libraries however i will be providing these libraries uh, zip file you can easily access that one uh, i will be providing this code a uh, whole code uh, uh, link in description down below okay so here we uh, in, uh, like uh, declared the pins like servo motor will be connected to six number pin uh, ISD1820 that is speaker module uh, will be connected to D7 and RST pin of uh, uh, RST pin of uh, RFID RC522 will be connected to uh, 9 SS pin that is SDA pin will be connected to uh, a 10 so remaining we don't need to uh, declare one uh, so according to the circuit diagram you can uh, uh, simply uh, make the connections and uh, this is uh, for uh, live uh, th this is for uh, LCD display with I2C and if you are not able to see the output on LCD display uh, for that also we have separate video follow that one and uh, you you can able to uh, get the output on uh, like a LCD display and see uh, here we are uh, mentioning the tag IDs so let me uh, select the board so here I am selecting the board as Arduino Uno and uh, port COM12 for your case it will be different so for my case it's COM12 and after all I am uh, just have, uh, just uh, need to upload the code. Okay, now it's been uploaded, and here this is the serial monitor, and open this one, and uh, board read as. 9600 if uh, like in your case it may vary if it varies then uh, you can select 96001 96001 okay so see uh, in the output we can able to see welcome to uh, door lock system in your lcd display also you should able to see this welcome to door lock system if you are not able to see uh, like you can prefer this video this video okay and yeah uh, so now I'm scanning the RFID tag. See here I'm able to get the RFID card UID. So simply I need to copy this and replace it over here. See I copied this one and replaced it over here. So now you can see it's saying access denied it. Access denied it okay so now i need to upload the code after updating uh, updating the uh, tag uid see as you can see the code is uploaded and again scanning see uh, in previous case before uh, uh, like updating the UID we were getting this access denied it now after up updating we are getting access granted S same this uh, same as this uh, we need to update these also so if you don't have multiple tags you can simply ignore this and uh, like if you have three tags or else if you wanted to add uh, two more then just need to add copy this one and paste over here and make it to uh, three and here also you need to mention as same as this okay so yeah uh, this code will be uh, uh, like uh, free and if you are not able to do and set up the project by me then uh, it's a paid like where we will uh, like uh, i will be uh, responsible for everything from starting to ending of the project and uh, through google meet 
so if you uh, are looking for it then uh, do contact me now and if you are looking for ready made project also uh, we are providing if you are looking for it then do contact and so let let us see the output how does it's working so as you can see it's working pretty fine and i hope you like this video then do hit that like button and also share this video among with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe for more such videos and i will see you in the next one